Another new tweet from CEO Adam Merritt. He says Market Watch currently is showing 93.79 billion apes outstanding. Clearly wrong, wildly so. We are calling them now, demanding that this gets corrected immediately. Also reviewing many other data sources to check for accuracy. So curse word here, irresponsible, that they publish false info. And this was quote tweeting a tweet from a day or so ago, which says many Twitter reports to me indicating 9.3 trillion apes are outstanding, or we have a $409 billion market cap. Clearly both are wrong, Adam Aaron says. Either a data service inexcusably is in error, or someone criminally Photoshop bogus numbers. To the extent possible, we have to aggressively chase this. And all the apes down below in this tweet are constantly posting different pieces of data that are obviously wrong. In the past few years, we've went over so many of the quote-unquote glitches that AMC and Ape have experienced. We've covered them on my channel and, ex and explained that something obviously weird is going on. Whether it's just mistakes within the data or there's something else more nefarious, obviously we don't really know. But either way, it's making us as shareholders very confused and it's obviously also going to make our minds wander. I love that CEO Adam Aaron is finally trying to step up and sort of go, go after this clearly wrong data. But on the same time, I fear that it might be too late for this. There's been so much false data, so much inaccurate information that has been spewed over the past few years and it's going to take a lot of work to clear everything up at this point. Comment down below what you think and comment down below the wildest inaccurate data and or glitch that you've seen up until this point. More financially literate than the average bear. So this is Janet Yellow right here. SVB is the biggest bank to fail since 2008 and a random nearby ape with five shares, the biggest bank so far. The apes have been calling this for a long time now, ever since the Evergrande situation. Well, well over a year ago, I've been covering on my channel that I've been very concerned about the banks and their over leveraged short positions and just the way they've been running things for some time now. This could be the black swan event to put everything into motion.